Hey you, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Guys, today we're going to be talking about the <laughs> of the national team of Genshin Impact. As funny as that sounds to me, um, it's actually a very like well-known team throughout the community. And it's actually a pretty, pretty decent team. So if you guys are considering on making a new team or something like that, you might want to look into this one. Anyways, the characters in this are as follows. Jangling is going to be your main DPS. Incredible apparently in this team. So yeah, anyways. Ping Cho as your second or sub DPS. Bennett and Chong Yun. But Chong Yun is a, you know, as a character here that you can replace. Uh, for someone like Sucrose maybe or Venti. Um, but of course, um, it's not quote unquote free to play friendly if you have Venti. Why this team is run by everyone is because Zhang Ling's elemental burst is really strong. <laughs> um, it's really strong with this team. What happens is every time the elemental burst is popped, you know, it's going to spin a bunch of a bunch of times. And every time it spins, it's going to do some more damage. Um, if I show you guys the Zhang Ling, obviously, um, the more constellation she has, the better, especially if you have this, which is Gooba is going to have Pyro Resistance reduced for 15% and so on and so forth. Anyways, we're going to move on. Pyronado, every time it swings, it's going to deal more damage. Uh, obviously, it has a base damage and it, the duration is long. It's 10 seconds long, but of course, it comes at a cost of 20 second cooldown and an energy cost of 80. Um, yes, that you're like, whoa, that's kind of bad, you know, this kind of sucks. Um, you're right, it does kind of suck that you have to have 80 to just get this done. But <laughs> the amount of worth it is, it, it it's very much worth it. And let me tell you why. Because every, you can switch her out. You can legit switch Jangling out as soon as you hit that elemental burst and it, it would stay on the field it would still work it would still proc and you, you can just move on be on your way to do whatever it may be and i feel like that's what, what makes it really powerful as well um so why this team is also run with xing Cho is because it's the same thing with jangling you can run this team alongside um xing Cho for the elemental burst and so what happens is you you know you use your elemental burst you use your e you get some of that energy back you switch you switch Xing Cho off and his elemental burst would still be going it would still be going it would still be on the field and if you use Zhang Ling's burst already too you'd just be consistently vaporizing your opponent over and over and over again it's not over there so what happens as well is this is how it goes first you, okay, so what happens is you, you can start off in whatever order you want, but usually you'd want to start with the Bennett, use your elemental burst to get that extra attack damage straight off the bat, and then you switch to Chong Yun, you use your elemental skill, this is going to leave a cryo field in which every attack you have will have cryo, uh, the cryo element enabled onto it, it's even your auto attacks, which is kind of crazy to me. So... After that, you switch to Xing Cho. It's important you switch to Xing Cho. If you switch to Zhang Ling and then Xing Cho, you're not going to do that much damage with his auto attacks because you don't really have your auto attacks, you know, leveled for Xing Cho. So you have Xing Cho on, you use his elemental burst, you use his elemental skill, and then you switch off the field straight off the bat like that. And if you have a sacrificial sword, this is amazing because you can use both your E's and then get off and you'll pretty much have your ult back if you have enough energy recharge, which is insane. And what, by the time you switch to Zhang Lei, you should still have all those stuff on the field because they last a long time. And you use your Zhang Lei elemental burst. Every time it spins, it's going to be stronger. It's going to apply Vaporize, especially with Xing Cho's Elemental Burst already proccing. And you also have Chong Yun's um, Elemental Skill going there. So you're applying Melt, you apply Vaporize, whatever it may be. So I'm going to show you guys some gameplay of my main account trying to do this on some bosses and some normal opponents. And we'll see how we go. 
All right, here it is. Zhang Ling, Xing Chou, Chang Yun, and Bennett. And we'll just have Yu Long in here. And we go. All right, I'm going to try my best to show this to you guys right here. Um, so yeah, we can start off with this. Just do a little bit of this. Um, <laughs> it, it's pretty much over. Oh uh, yeah, but you can see how much damage I deal. Um, if only my crit rate was a little higher with Zhangling. But it is what it is. It's pretty good. If you guys want to just uh, start freezing them, just put on the that and then just go this. And just start... <laughs> <laughs> just start hitting them. Um, if you want the permanent freeze, you just do this. You have Chang Yun's field out. And uh, you just keep hitting him. Which is um, pretty <laughs> pretty crazy with Xing Chou's uh, burst. And uh, yeah, we can just keep going for as long as we need to. But if you ult with Zhang Ling and then perform some melt, it's always going to be so much better. And you're just going to destroy their entire team pretty pretty fast. So, yeah, I thought this was pretty cool. I love the melt, co uh, the melt comp. It's so good. It, it is genuinely so good. But, you know, every national team has its national team eliminator. <laughs> and that's you. <laughs> oh, whole team, bro. Who needs a whole team? Have you on your team and you're good to go. And your national team do this. <laughs> it's Anyways, ladies and gents, that's gonna be it for today. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel as well. What do you think of the national team? I think it's absolutely stupid. It's incredible. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.